What's up, guys? So I'm here with Vardan's entire family and some of my friends. Say hi. Hi. We're gonna try to pull a trick on Vardan that I saw on Twitter. It's where people try to convince their younger siblings that they're invisible. <laughs> <laughs> you want to be the one to disappear? Hell yeah. Really? Yeah. Anything to get rid of my family. <laughs> <laughs> there goes nothing. Okay, hold on one second. Ready? She me commentage era. No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Vardan! Vardan, if you're here, take a picture with me! <gasps> I feel him, I feel him. I literally have my hand David, David, you hear me? I have my hand on him. David, you hear me? Oh my god! Vardan, take a picture! Take a picture! Vardan, take a picture! Take a picture! Take a picture. Take a picture. Take a picture. Take a picture. I'm smiling, I'm sorry, you got it. You got it, let me see, let me see. Oh my god! 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 Oh my god, the papers are moving! Pardon, if you're here, grab this from my hand. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Put him in the chair. Oh, he's here. He's here. Put him back. Put him back. Put it back. Put it back. Oh, chill, chill. Brock hot ties. Fima! Oh my god. Was that cool? No, no. I'm grabbing this, but you guys couldn't see me. And you guys got freaking out. Oh my god. I don't know. Hold on, can I tell you something? We saw you the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. sorry. Wait, how, how did you do that? We took the picture earlier. <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah. <laughs> I felt so bad. I know, I know. When he started crying. I was laughing so hard. <laughs> did you actually think you were invisible? Yeah. <laughs> now I could go to school and brag. I'd be like, I was invisible. You weren't, though. You do know that, right? <laughs> When you take the blindfold off, you're gonna be reacting to it in a cute way. So you'll be like, oh, it's so cute. Okay. okay. And so I should be scared until I realize it's cute. Yes. I love me for that. <laughs> okay. Put your arms to your side. No! <laughs> Good, you can't move around. Don't move around too much. We're bringing it in. We're bringing it in. All right, here we go. Pretend it's a really cute animal. Okay. Okay, go. Okay, we're putting it on you. The, 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 what? David, what the fuck? <laughs> David! What the fuck? Oh my god, stop it. <laughs> it's on my fucking head. Get fucking off of me. No. <laughs> Thumbnail. <laughs> What's up guys, so last year I pulled a prank on Seth where he thought he was making out with Corinna, but he was really making out with Jason. <laughs> Seth, 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 Seth. Oh! Too long after that, I had an idea to pull the prank on him again, so I thought it would be fun to blatantly ask him for consent. Do I have permission to try to prank you again and get you to make out with Jason? I'm very confused by that, because how the hell could you be so confident to tell me that I have to consent to something that I'm not going to know that I'm going to do? <laughs> this is how we were going to do it. I went over to my friends at Collab to see if they would help me make a fake beef jerky commercial. We created a fake production company that created a fake script. So we're about to send out this email to Seth for this beef jerky commercial. Fake, fake beef jerky. <laughs> Ourselves. This is not real. But we're offering $2,500. Which is also not which real. Which is also not real. <laughs> we created a fake website to go along with a fake production company. I mean, this thing is entirely functional. If I click on learn more, it's going to show a page with all of the clients that we've worked with. <laughs> and within two days, Seth responded to his fake audition with a real audition tape. I'm here with Zach Link's auditioning for the part of <laughs> <laughs> What a fucking moron. <laughs> we gave it a couple hours, and then we gave him a call with some really exciting news. Welcome to the the beef jerky family, man. We're super, super excited to have you. Well, it's great to be a part of the family, man. A couple days later, it was time for the shoot, so we hired three women to play the sexy Sasquatches so that Seth wouldn't notice when Jason switched out with one of them mid shoot. And then we made sure to hire an additional 14 crew members, along with a director, producer, assistant director, makeup crew, and audio technician. And this was all happening while the rest of us sat in a tiny trailer outside the house watching his every move on a tiny screen. We wanted to make sure that Seth believed the commercial was real, so we shot it just like it was planned, and then we saw slowly transitioned into the prank, and this is how it turned out. She's clear. Action. Oh, shit! That is some hot ass jerky. Mm -hmm.
Thomas. Ooh, who's this? And actually carry. Yeah, then to each other. Oh, maybe a little Sasquatch kitsch. Ooh, that's good. Okay, that's nice. Action Lindsay. And just keep working with each other. Yeah, really pay attention. Really get into them. Maybe a little motorboat over there. Okay, make a crash, make room. Open up, we still want to see. Camera get in, can you get, are you getting this? Get in. Yeah, yeah, crash open yeah. up. This, you guys, it's amazing. Keep going, it's so good, it's so good. It's so good. Super hot. Super sexy. Super Sasquatch sexy. Oh my god. Yes. And congrats on your commercial, Seth. Seth, can we just do one more take? <laughs> you fuck every single one of you motherfuckers! You're the best. You're the fucking best, baby. This motherfucker told me that this was gonna happen again. And I can always respect the fucking man that keeps his word. <laughs> How was that for you? Better the second time. Alright, what's up guys? So Zane is about to film a Q&A with Scott and Todd. But what Todd doesn't know is that during the q and I'm gonna throw in a smoke bomb into the room. <laughs> What is the worst thing David has done to you? Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. I knew when he said that question, I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> god damn it. And your fucking head pops up. Why was your first instinct to shut the window? My first instinct was that you're gonna throw more in. I'm like, fuck you. Hey, what's up, guys? My friend Nick, who we all call Jonah, has a bit of an ego. When I get my first major role, I'm gonna go like, hey, guys, by the way, uh, fuck David Dobrik. Fuck <laughs> We've tried multiple times to bring him down back to earth, but it's just not working. So this time we decided to try a new approach. So I had my manager call him and tell him that Seth Rogen and Judd Apatow are interested in him being the new lead role. Role in Knocked Up 2. Uh, Jonah! Hey, what's up, dude? Right now, they are casting Knocked Up 2. I think it's like the third lead in the entire movie. Oh, shit, that'd be fucking sick as shit. I mean, I've like trained acting myself, but never the second city, and I've been doing comedy since I was like 13. My manager told him not to mention anything to his friends, but of course he couldn't resist. So, you don't talk about this, I swear to God. They're strongly considering me to play Jonah Hill's little brother in Knocked Up 2. <laughs> And manifest what you want, fuck you guys. <laughs> I don't think you have the acting chops to be in a movie like that. Fuck you. I absolutely motherfucking do, motherfucker. No, I don't. I'm the best fucking actor in the room. Then we had Doug's assistant, Doug being a made-up studio executive, schedule a meeting with Jonah for the following day. Yes, thank you. We're all really excited. This is gonna be amazing. Okay, sounds good. Thank you so much. Hey, have a good night. Nice. <laughs> you can have it. Oh my god. That was really good. You did great. Yeah, it was okay. awesome. <laughs> the next day we headed over to the studio and had that act as Seth Rogen's agency. We had our buddy Nick playing Doug and and then his co-workers playing the agents at the agency. During the meeting, we're gonna have Seth Rogen call in, who's played by Vincent, who's gonna be on the phone. Hey Seth, how are you? I'm, I'm doing good, man. How, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> and to make sure Jonah believes it all, we had Brandon type up a fake script that Jonah is gonna read at the meeting. But of course, the whole thing wouldn't be complete without a fun little message for Jonah on page four of his script. <laughs> <laughs> and now we were finally ready to do the prank. Alright guys, I'm going out there. End his life! End his life! Very happy to have you. Hey. Hello. Everyone, Hi. this is going. Just to our head of Nice to meet you. Great to meet you. This is also Nick. Uh, Seth can be here, but he wanted to just talk to you really quickly. Seth, Seth. Hey, Seth, how you doing, Seth? Hey, dude, what's up? How's it going? I'm, I'm great. Thank you for doing this, man. Yeah, for, thank you for having me. I gotta run, man. Okay. I just want to say, uh, congrats, man. Uh, looking forward to working with you. <laughs> oh, 
shit. Thanks, thanks. You know, I was trying to get off of YouTube as soon as I fucking could. My second city teachers would have been pissed off at me. Mm. If I told them I do fucking YouTube. Really? Really? You I mean, like YouTube. I, you, I, yeah. I love my friends. My friends are in Adobe shit. So, what I'm I'm gonna I want to do really quickly go over a couple pages of the script. Hi, my name is Nick Antonia, and I'm reading for Stefan. One more with energy. Oh, God! Dear. Lord Jesus, help me! We hear a, lo a loud fart followed by shit falling into the toilet. That's like Satan's coming out of my asshole! More farting and shit falling into the toilet. Uh, I wouldn't go under a fire, you. It's like Hiroshima. So I'll just come out and say it. I got her knocked up. I'm fat and I'm ugly and I've never even seen a vagina. Best advice I'll ever give you. You ready? <laughs> Welcome back to YouTube, Jonah. Jonah, good news. They said you were. They said you were actually really good. They said you were good. We didn't get the part because there wasn't one. But. I would shoot you in both your fucking knees. I know, dude, you, said that you said in there that we were all great. <laughs> yeah. You, you, you said you loved us. And I texted yeah, I fucking did. I hate you guys. <laughs> I texted the group chat and I'm like, he just said he loves us. Can't wait to see what he says in 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> what happened when you saw the page of the middle finger? I little, I, I never felt so defeated. <laughs> <laughs> to the point where I'm like, I want my career to end now. <laughs> Can I be real with you guys? Can I be real with you guys? That's the phrase vlog. <laughs> This is Matt. He's gonna play the ice cream truck driver. We're gonna try to lure his little brother in to get free ice cream, and we're gonna try to kidnap him. And this is all to teach him a lesson about stranger danger. I'm just imagining this vlog shown on a courtroom wall. <laughs> we got the ice cream truck because we know Jonah. Well, you know, finally, this relationship's working out for us. <laughs> Don't let anyone ever tell you you're not a man without connections. <laughs> ice cream truck is ready. This is a dream come true, David. Look, guys, the ice cream truck music is on. There comes Jonah's little brother. Oh my god. Oh my god. Here we come. Hey, what's up, little man? What's up? What can I get you? One get bump up and then um, another. I actually watch you guys all the time. Oh, thank you. Me and my girlfriend love David and Liza. I'll tell you what, how about this? I'll give you a whole case of bomb pop, but you have to give them to David and tell him I love him. Oh, uh, no, it's okay. You don't want a whole case? No, it's all right. I don't, I don't want to get you in trouble. I'll just tell them. Okay, cool. I might be out of bomb pops. I got a deal for you. I'm actually going to give you two boxes because you're on the vlog and I'm a huge fan. Hey, come back here. Come come get these with me. I, um, I can't. You can't? No. You don't want to pop back here and help me carry him out? No. I'll be with you one second, man. I, I, I don't want it. I don't need it. You don't need it? He's a good kid? He's a good kid? <laughs> Holy shit! Am I that creepy? <laughs> he said I don't want it and ran away. <laughs> oh my god. Lord on. We were testing to see if you were getting a random person's ice cream truck and you did it. So I was literally so scared. Lord <laughs> on, I've never been so proud of you for fucking up the bit. <laughs> Dude, that was impressive. He legit did everything you should have. Right now, be honest with me. If you were a little hungrier, would you have gotten in? Uh, yeah. <laughs> what were you thinking? I thought he was going to kidnap me. How did you find that out? Because he started getting in my van. <laughs> Ice cream is one thing. If it was kebab, my ass might be kidnapped. <laughs> Decided Dom should just stop messing around and pick a girl that he likes. And what better way to do it than a good old-fashioned makeout competition. So today we have Tori and Brooke here. And today we're going to be seeing... Oh. Brooke, that's her name. Okay. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Brooke! <laughs> and we have Tori! <laughs> and we have the reigning scumbag of all time! <laughs> Dom, we're gonna blindfold you and you're gonna choose your woman. Alexa, play love making music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, go, Dom. The first one. So gross. Yeah. <laughs> okay, how was that? Good. You're gonna be here to make out Dom. Yeah. Because you've been dying to. I've been really dying to. It's kind of creepy. Yeah, yeah, you go. You're it's not gonna be Jason, right? No. I'm over here. Okay. Jason, keep is talking. Bro, is this a no. Going <laughs> <laughs> Alright, go, go, go. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, how was that? That was better. <laughs> One or two. Don't take it off yet. One or two. 
whoever the second person was. <laughs> Number two is your option. <laughs> I'm gonna open your eyes and you're gonna tell me who you thought you kissed. Here's your date for tomorrow. It's her? No, she's right behind you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you like Ethan's kiss? Yeah, honestly, he was the best kisser out of all the girls. <laughs> Fuck yeah! I'm stoked on that. Ethan, how did it feel for you? I was so excited. Literally, I canceled on six people just now to come over here. <laughs> okay, so my friend Todd just got a brand new Range Rover. So I'm gonna make sure that he really, really loves it. And I'm gonna do this by surprising him with a brand new paint job. When David does his little whisper times in the vlogs, you're like, oh my god, what the fuck's gonna happen? You feel like you're watching a thriller movie. You're like, oh my god, fuck yeah, David, go! <laughs> You ready to go fast? Oh, fu oh my god, not this again. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, I don't know if I can be in the vlog squad. <laughs> <laughs> 20 in the morning. These two just got done wrapping Todd's car. Okay, ready? I'm so nervous. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Dude, 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 he's gonna kill me. Oh my god. Dude, I've been looking at your face for three fucking hours. A hundred thousand dollar car just wrapped in my face. It actually looks good. Like, I'm kind of annoyed that it looks good. Morning. What? What? What are you doing? What? Why are you so <laughs> I'm gonna be pretty honest with you. I took your car keys last night. Why? Because I love you. Put this blindfold on. What'd you do to my car? <laughs> I don't want another surprise. I did something for you. Open your eyes, buddy. <laughs> you wrapped your fucking car. <laughs> it's me! Oh my god. I can't drive this! Yeah, you can. I can't! Yeah, you can! What the fuck? <laughs> How do you think of this stupid shit? What the fuck, dude? What the fucking fuck? God damn it! And you thought this car couldn't get any sexier. Are you gonna keep it? Literally, yeah. <laughs> Why are they so against piercings in your culture? I don't know. What do you think your mom's reaction is gonna be like? So I brought this up to my mom like a year ago. I'm like, hey, I want to get my ears pierced. Fucking, he's like, if you walk in with pierced ears pierced, I want you to walk the fuck out. <laughs> they think we pierce serious kebabs. <laughs> you have huge earlobes. I know, bro. Why are Jonah's earlobes like personal pan pizza? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You can't see him because his cheeks covered his ears. <laughs> I was marking them and I was like, shit. Jordan, you follow the rules, right? No Krispy Kreme seven days before Christmas. <laughs> Are you nervous? <laughs> no, I'm not. Jordan, no, here it comes, hold buddy. One, two, and three. We all look so good. It looks so good, Jonah. One, two, and three. Yes, yes. Fuck, oh, Jesus Christ, Damien. What the fuck? Oh, oh my God. Here we go. One, two, and three. Oh. <laughs> you, got, you got this. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god, you are beautiful! <laughs> oh my god, he just got stabbed! Go, <laughs> <Yeah>, check this out. <laughs> yes! Yes! I'm so happy! We have a surprise. Three, two, one. Surprise. <laughs> Oh, Can I show you something? Huh, sure. Are you in a good mood today? <laughs> You'd never be mad at me, right? No. No, no. no. it's not possible. Because no, no, no. we I love each no. other. I love you. Yes. I love you. <laughs> Jonah, you want to show her the surprise? Yeah, sure, Mom. Uh, here, here it is. <laughs> oh my god, no! I hate you! No, take out! No! Oh, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. No! Oh, no, 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 no! no, no, no. <laughs> I love you so much. Uh -huh. This is not. I know. See, I, I, I am woman and I don't have. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Can you guys close your eyes so I can show you the final surprise? What kind of surprise? One ear for his dick. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you guys to open your eyes in three, two, one, sec. one sec. I'm really scared. I'm really scared. One, turn around. We're going to jail. <laughs> Calm, calm down. I swear to God, it, it, it's done in like a week. I just take it off. It's really bad. Mom, take, take it out now. Take, take no, 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 no. We're taking it out. Take he it actually out. needs to take that out now because his nipples were too small for these. <laughs>
got kicked off our flight because Jason was dressed like this. Since we're at the airport again, I bought Jason a really comfy outfit. <laughs> and there's Jason in his new comfy outfit. It looks so suspicious. <laughs> I think it was scaring some of the passengers. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? When we first got on the flight, a woman came up to me and she goes, Is he really a prisoner? <laughs> This is what I do, I go, I go, yeah, yeah. And she goes, oh, and I go, I'm kidding. <laughs> Jason needed the key to unlock his little wristband and thing. And I was like, you're not getting the key back. And I put it into Todd's mouth, and Todd swallowed the key. And then Zane goes, dude, did you really swallow that? Yeah. yeah. And he tapped a flight attendant and goes, ma'am, we're gonna need a doctor on board. <laughs> and it freaked her out so much. And then we proceeded to get kicked off the plane. <laughs> <laughs> Jason, that's the most appropriate outfit to get arrested in. <laughs> Houston, we have a problem. That's very vlog. Thanks for watching Cynthia. Make sure you like and subscribe. Tweet me at David Dobrik. So the moral of this story is don't go to the airport and wear stupid outfits. Jason, you ready? Alright, here we go. <laughs>